Whoa, there it is! What? Oh my god, oh my god. it looks crazy disgusting, dude. Why is he holding this shit, man? It did not avoid it, it make me jump. There's a worm feeling different on oh, the Yeah, I can feel like tense up. Whoa, there it is! Oh. Holy... What the hell? It's shaking all over me. Ah. I bet! Ah. I bet it does! Gross. Oh, it stinks. Yeah, it's oh, not yeah, supposed it to smell oh, good. Man, yeah, gross. Gross. You get on your ass. Ugh. I didn't even hurt the blood from my life. First time. In most areas around the world, when the ocean tides recede, they reveal a hidden coastline that is made up of shallow intertidal pools, many of which are filled with colorful plants and bizarre looking marine creatures. However, when the tide pulls back from the inlets and estuaries around Harpswell, Maine, you are often left with an endless expanse of mudflats. These exposed all right, layers we're not finna hell no, we finna skip through all this shit. And while they may look Get like a the blood worm, they the usually blood support worm. a large population of wildlife. Where is this damn blood worm? He was looking for it. I want to see him with that damn thing in his fucking hand. Boom, there you go, right there. Boom, there it is. Hell Be yeah. humble. In the sweet spot, it's the honey hole. Let me see. Oh, yeah, look at that. That's, that's what I've been doing yeah. every day. Yeah. What do you got? Let me see. Yeah, that's Whoa. Me. That's crazy. That's, that's what I dig every day. Worms like it's that. What? Yeah. Hell hey, oh, no. Nah. Just coming out. Whoa. <laughs> Big head. Alien, oh, isn't it? You can see Anthony's excited. That means this is a good worm right here. Yeah. Wow, look at that. Eat Woo. that thing, man. Eat right. it. We are getting closer to the honey hole. Yeah. I'm going to put this beast yeah. in the bucket. Show Anthony what we found. Oh, look that's that. a sandworm. That's a sandworm? That's a sandworm. They bite too. Hell wow. No. Okay. Yeah. Well, at least we found a big one. Woo. Hey, so mighty you. <laughs> what the fuck? Blood worming on the coast of Maine. Blood. Oh, there's a good one. Yeah. Yeah. Yes! Oh, that's a good oh, one. That's oh, that's a big one! Oh, man. Yes! yes. Got, one. Got one! Hell no! Where is this shit biting at, man? Come on. Brought him up in the mud! Woo! There you go, right muddy, there. But it finally Hell yeah, there it is. Goddamn. Into this clear container so that we can actually see him. You see, look in there. Oh, there's the big. Oh, there's one of our big worms there. Is this salt water right here? Yes, this is salt water. This is a marine species of worm, which means that they live in salt water. If I were to actually put these worms in fresh water, it would kill them. So we do need to be rather gentle with them. Oh, there's a big one right there. Oh, that is, oh, that's one of the big, look at this. That's yeah, one not. of the big ones right there. Oh yeah. Oh boy. Yeah, that could give you a good yeah, bite. Yeah. All right, get in there, buddy. Okay, I'm gonna move this bucket off of here. So we'll get rid of the water bucket. And now we're gonna get up close with these worms. Now, we do have a pretty decent size ragworm here. Anthony also called these sandworms. You see that? I think it's crazy looking. Right, look at the iridescence to its skin. And you can see, if you zoom in there, all these little legs on the side, those are called parapodia, and that actually helps these marine worms not only swim, but also burrow. And Man, this also that is so nasty, bro. It looks kind of like caterpillar long. a little bit. But that's about its most shrunken up state right there. Hell right, no. I'm gonna go What's ahead and put this one back bad. into the mud bucket. Crazy. Ooh, what do we have next? Man, the moment we've been waiting for, the blood worm which is exactly what we are going out after today. I wasn't even Hell aware nah. that we would find Can't other mess with it, man. Species. I cannot touch and it. And a no. container full of them. Um, now, I'm going to just dump the whole oh. thing into my oh. hand. Okay. You ready? Mm -hmm. Just so we can see what that looks like. What? They look dead as hell. He's going to smell them. Really? Look a lot like earthworms. Do they smell, they smell like mud? Okay. <laughs> they they live like mud. in the mud. <laughs> they absolutely smell like mud. And like most worms, they'll just kind of stay completely limp in your hand like that. 
and oh, I can feel him moving. They don't seem to move as fast as an earthquake. How's he going by? No. He ain't got no damn All right, I'm going to just kind of single out the biggest ones. And you may be wondering to yourselves, oh, it's putting out, that one's putting out his mouth. Oh, that is a rather big one. Okay. There are one, two, three, four, five really good sized blood worms, but I think the biggest are these two right here in the middle. So we're gonna pare this down. I'm trying to let them get comfortable and expand out. I also wanna see if there's one that's going to perform for us with what we're all waiting to see, which is that weird alien looking head that they shoot out of the think, front of their face. I think face. that one, that one you just This touched. one right that there. That one seems to be the most lively. Yeah, that one also seems to be the, the largest in diameter. All right, we're gonna put these back. Now, one thing that I must note up front, I'm not going to intentionally try to be bitten by this worm, but this is one of the only venomous worm species oh, in the oh, world. There, the right there, you see that? You see the head come out? They have a proboscis that they shoot out of the front of their head, which has four fangs. Those fangs are made of copper, and they're like this, right? It's like a grappling hook. Hold up, hold up. Like metal? Like metal. Mm -hmm. like the element Damn. Copper. And Ew, no. metal teeth. It has metal teeth. Like a Bond villain. Like a Bond villain. You got it. Yes. This is like one of the most bizarre creatures. I didn't even know these things existed until we got here to Maine and somebody said, you want to go looking for blood worms? And sure enough, this is that creature. Now this worm is a predator and when they're out hunting they'll kind of slink through the mud and they're searching for crustaceans or small invertebrates and they shoot this grappling hook type head out of their proboscis four fangs dig in and then with those fangs they inject venom that venom paralyzes and sometimes even stops the heart of its victim and then they sit there <sighs> and slurp up the innards like a slushy. Now, okay, this is really cool. You see how it's completely slinked out like this? Notice that coloration. You see how purple it is? Yeah. It's all peach colored here and purple here. That's why they're called blood worms because their insides are actually dark red and the skin is semi-translucent and you can see that coloration right through there. Wow, that's cool. Bro, is he ever gonna like, like do what he said he was gonna do? And yeah, he was like, give me a goddamn blood. Look down the side of his body there. You see how it looks like the spikes coming off? I don't know. Like hair. Oh, okay. Right there. Marine creature is cut in any area above pretty much this line right here. Damn about all this. I want to see you get bit by it. Look at that, you can actually see the colors Whatever, going yeah. through its body. Woo! Did you try to bite me there? I think I was thinking about it. Show me your proboscis. Got his ass! Got his ass! Ow! Yay! Did it bite you? He got me! <laughs> I got that! He got me! Got I his ass! It was a little pinch! Let me see. Where'd he get you? Right there. Right in the crux of my finger. That's it! It was like a little pinprick. Ah! <laughs> Does it hurt? Yeah, a little bit. A little bit. It kind of itches, actually. <laughs> yeah, did you see that? You think you got that? Oh, I know I got it. Oh, man. Hell no. You just kind of no. done with that. and nailed me. Alright y'all, that was it on that. It's your boy Curly Q. If you liked the video, leave a like and sub for more. We'll see y'all next time. Peace.